Hey guys, what's up? It's Scott with Let's Keep It Simple. And today, we're going to be jailbreaking the second generation Apple TV with the Season Pass on 4.3, aka 4.2.2. But before we get started, there's a couple things I want to show you first, so that way you won't get iTunes Air 1601 or iTunes Air. This device is eligible for the requested build. If you've ever downgraded any of your devices before, you'll need to restore your host files. Basically, just make sure it looks like this. If you've never modified your host files, then don't worry. You also need to make sure you have the most recent version of Season Pass. There's a link in the description and delete any older copies. Okay, so now let's get started. First, open up Season Pass and press Create IPSW. After about three minutes, it'll create a custom IPSW and the prompt will display saying, waiting for device to enter DFE mode. At this point, plug in the micro USB cable and press and hold the home and power button on the Apple TV for seven seconds and then let go. Now just sit back and relax as iTunes restores the custom IPSW. You shouldn't get any iTunes errors anymore, but if you do, just send me a message and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. So when you plug in your Apple TV, you'll notice that when you turn it on, that season pass is there. But unlike the Green Poison jailbreak, Neato TV isn't pre-installed and season pass doesn't have an installer. It just says jailbreak successful. So you'll need to be able to install Neato TV to be able to download the rest of your packages. And luckily the install instructions haven't changed at all. So click here if you want to see how to install Neato TV. There'll also be a link for the written guide below. Well, thanks for watching this video. I'd love it if you checked out my new Facebook page at facebook.com backslash let's keep it simple and follow me on Twitter at let's keep it simple without the E. Well, I'll see you next time.